Our Gal Toolkit extension has a ton of amazing title animation templates that you can customize to your own brand located in our titles category. But one of the titles that gets overlooked is our film titles, which are designed to emulate a cinematic style. So you can customize any of these for any type of purpose, right? So inside my timeline, I had the stock video clip and I want to apply this title on top. You can drag and drop it or you can double click to apply it and you can extend the duration to any amount that you need. So you can see this is what it looks like here. It looks very fancy and nice, but to customize it, go up to the properties panel here and here we can update our text. Let's update text A to New York City. Let's update text B to Manhattan. And let's update text C to the city that never sleeps. Fantastic. And then if you don't want this text at the bottom here, if you don't have anything to add to get rid of it, just delete it and then it goes away. Just like all of our other motion graphics templates, you can update the colors here just by clicking on it and then choosing your color. So basically, if you wanna update the text in the badge text, you can just go over here and you can update this to anything. For example, Sundance Film Fest and then winner, for example. So you can go in and you can update this if you need to. So you can go in and do this for all the different badge texts, but if you don't want the badges at all, you can go down to badges here and just reduce the scale to zero. And now they're completely gone. So now you just have this nice title without that kind of film award look, and it works perfectly for any type of intro for any video, like a vlog, for example. There are other controls, of course, that you can manipulate here. You can add motion blur, you can add a background or a shadow, or you can update the in and out animation speed or turn off the out animation. In this case, I'm just gonna turn on a background color just to make it a little bit darker and you can control the opacity of the background here and you can update the background color. For example, if you want it to be more of a midnight blue color and now it has updated. So that way that background is overlaid behind the text. And that's all there is to it. Give this video a thumbs up if it helped you out and go to premiergal.com slash toolkit to explore the thousands of different elements and effects that we've designed for the Gal Toolkit extension. Thanks so much for watching. See you next time. Bye.